Okay, hello again, everybody. Welcome back. Um, I hope that you found today's session interesting and stimulating. Um, maybe it was a bit more challenging um, than some of our previous sessions, maybe especially for new members, because it was the second part of a discussion that we started a month ago. And also, I think some aspects of it are, are fairly technical. But nonetheless, I hope you were able to get past the technicalities to the heart of the matter and remembering um, that our purpose is to tell the politicians what the problem is. So I'm looking forward to getting the feedback from the sessions in a few minutes. But before we wrap up for today, I just want to remind you that we're organizing two evening discussions on Thursday the 10th of December and Monday the 14th of December, both at 7 p.m. Now these are both optional meetings and you can choose, you need only choose one, whichever date would suit you best because the meetings will be essentially the same from our side. They will be different depending on the different members who attend. But um, you may remember that we discussed this a little bit before and um, we said that the meetings would be optional and we will record both sessions so that anybody who's interested in what we discussed would be able to find the recording on the website. Um, um, and there are people not in the assembly but outside it who are also interested in how the assembly is running so it will be publicly available as well. Now the main reason for organizing this meeting is um, because we feel that those who there are some members who would like to have an open discussion on how are we getting on to date to take stock of where we are uh, to get any suggestions that you may have on how we organize our work next year and for anybody who feels there's something missing or something that should be changed in the way that we organize the assembly this will be the opportunity to have a discussion with us I'm picking up, I think, from several members um, that you might like to get more information on how we're planning to handle the preparation of the recommendations and how we're planning to vote um, at the end of our work. And so we'll, we'll outline our ideas at these meetings and we we'll look forward to getting your reactions and suggestions. Um, we're doing this because I think we all recognize it's harder to build a feeling of citizen ownership of the process when we can only meet online because it has to be much more organized and, and disciplined. But I do hope you feel that we're doing everything in our power to respond to your wishes. And by joining one or other of these two evening meetings, you'd have the opportunity to have your say and to help us shape um, the remaining sessions for next year. So mentioning next year, I promised that I would um, repeat the dates that we have um, scheduled. Uh, we did send them to you a very long time ago. So we'll also send them out to you by email um, in the coming days. But our next meeting will be on the 16th of January. So it's always on a Saturday. And the topic then will be care. Now we've touched on care almost in every session because it's an issue that crosses all the, all the different topics. So I think that will be a very interesting session. Following that, we will have another meeting on the 13th of February, again on the 13th of March, and uh, the weekend of the 17th of April, as of now, should be our last session. But we'll discuss all of that as we get closer to it, and we'll also discuss it at the evening, at the evening meetings. Um, so um, in the coming weeks, you will get the by now regular flow of videos and papers to stimulate your thinking. And I really look forward to continuing our work together next year. Uh, we're going to be concluding now in a moment. So um, to those of you who will not be joining either of the evening meetings and so therefore who I won't see before the end of the year, I want to wish you and your loved ones a happy, a safe and a healthy Christmas and a very good start to next year. I want to thank you for the work that we've done together this year through all the difficulties. Um, who could have imagined when we started in Dublin Castle that we would all be online and mastering the technology and able to make it work despite everything that COVID can throw at us. So I'm very optimistic that next year we'll be able to continue our work and bring it to a successful conclusion. And as I say, we're keen um, to maximize your ownership of the process and to get all your ideas on how that will be. So I'm going to conclude now. For those of you who want to stay online, please do. And then you can hear the feedback from the uh, different breakout groups. For anybody who has to go now, we'll upload um, the recording of the feedback on the website. 
and you'll be able to see it um, early next week, I hope. But again, I really want to thank you all. It's, I feel really it's an enjoyable experience um, having this engagement with you, hearing your views, seeing all the different reactions that there are. Uh, we've certainly enjoyed doing the preparation and the harvest that's coming back to us is extremely rich. So I'm happy in the belief that we'll be able to bring this to a good conclusion um, in the first part of next year. So stay safe and um, have a good Christmas and we'll see you on the 16th of January, if not before at the one or other of the evening sessions. So take care and bye bye now.